Clearwater, Florida, and Marcus and I just decided to take a little spontaneous vacation. Um, and we're at a hotel by the beach, and we're so excited to just spend a few days here and relax. We were actually supposed to go to a camp this week, like a youth camp, and that's why we had the week off. And last minute, it got canceled and decided that we were just gonna, you know, use it as a little mini vacation since I never really got to finish like my birthday celebration. If you guys ended up watching my last vlog or my birthday vlog, I did mention that I was going to continue like vlogging and I was going to do a part two that never ended up happening. We were going to do some more birthday celebrations, go to the beach, go to Tampa on my actual like birthday and we couldn't because we got a call that we would possibly or that we possibly could have had COVID since we were exposed um, to a friend who did test positive. So we had a quarantine for two whole weeks and I was not able to leave my house for my birthday and so that was fun and so thankfully we both ended up getting a negative result and so finally we are celebrating my birthday so we are gonna just spend some time at the beach at the pool walk around and just enjoy a few days off and it should be fun so hopefully you guys enjoy spending the weekend with us and like always every time that like I do a vacation or any like hotel kind of weekend type thing I always show you guys around I'm gonna show you guys around this hotel room. It's nothing crazy. We honestly did this so last minute and since it's right next to the beach, we didn't wanna to spend too much money. So it's nothing special. It's a very small room. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys around. It shouldn't take long. <laughs> so when you walk in, it's really like the only thing that there is. It's a very small room, but it's enough. We're really gonna just be spending the whole time outside anyway, but this is our bed. Nice and clean, like I always mention. <laughs> and it has a little area next to each side. Cute little lounging area, nothing crazy. A little TV and then the city view, which is nice. The only thing that kind of sucks is that this is the only window. And like there's no privacy. Like there's no privacy, like what's it called? Like sh blind. So it's either everyone can like walk right by and see you or it's completely dark. So that's my only downside with this. I wish it had like a like a white sheet kind of thing so I can have the sunlight without everyone really like peeping into our private life um but yeah and then over here you know just a little area to put your stuff little lock thing and then I'll show you the bathroom in a second since Marcus is in there this is the bathroom I'm very excited about sorry that the toilet's really loud but I'm really excited about the bathtub because even if it is a small bathroom, I can still take a bath and you know that I always come ready for that when it comes to hotels. Got my bath bomb. So yeah. All right guys, so Marcus and I are officially settled in and we are about to go to the pool, go for a walk, and then later tonight we're gonna go on a boat ride. So I'm really excited about that just one of my favorite things is the ocean, so I can't wait to bring you guys along.
morning. It is day two of our mini vacation. Last night we ended up going on a little boat trip and then having dinner along the beach. Um, everything was very spontaneous. We honestly had nothing planned for this trip and we went on TripAdvisor, looked up a few things to do and decided to do the sunset boat ride along Clearwater Beach. It was so much fun. We were on the boat for two hours though and we thought it was going to be a little bit shorter because it said it was going to be an hour and 45 and I think it was more than two hours actually and we were starving. So we got out of the boat and like ran to the nearest hotel, I mean restaurant, and definitely ate so much. We were so hungry. So that was delicious. We went back to the hotel, watched a movie, and knocked out. And now this morning, we slept in just a little, but we had to be downstairs because there was a free um, breakfast. And that ended at 10 in the morning, so we had to be there before that. And since it is quarantine, we really couldn't like sit there. We had to take it all to go, and so there was limited options. So we, Marcus got an English muffin, I toasted a bagel, and then we went to Starbucks for some coffee. So we are full and ready for a full day. We're gonna go to the beach. That's why I have no makeup on, and I'm literally just like bumming it out. We're gonna go to the beach all day, maybe rent an umbrella. Well, I'm most likely gonna rent an umbrella because it gets hot out there, and I'm not gonna be at the beach all day in the sun. We're already like toasty. As you can tell, I have a little sunburn from this week. We went to the beach with my mom and my sister. So I think we're trying to definitely be under some shade all day. But yeah, I'm really excited. Beach days are my favorite and we usually don't go for like a full on day because it's just overwhelming in Florida. It's so hot. So we're gonna go as long as we can, maybe come back into the hotel if we get too hot, have some lunch and then go back out. My goal is to hopefully see the sunset on the beach but we'll see because it's like the same time as like dinner and we want to get some sushi tonight so we'll see how it plays out but yeah got my starbucks and i'm ready for the day i'm so excited <music> officially back at the beach. Marcus and I decided to do some McDonald's for lunch just because we're doing sushi tonight so keeping a little cheaper for lunch and so now I'm just here at the beach. Marcus went back to the hotel just because he can't take the beach all day but I wanted to be here a little bit longer since we have a hotel so why not stay here all day um, and we have a cabana so I'm chilling. I'm about to start reading Live Love Lead which is really exciting. I heard this is really good. So I'm gonna just use this time to relax, read a book, just enjoy just being next to the beach. It's my favorite thing, hearing the ocean, just so relaxing. And yeah, plus we have a lot of water, so I'm 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 good. So I'll see you guys later. for dinner and I am wearing the same thing as I did this morning and I'm most likely gonna wear this tomorrow again um, but it's comfy and it's cute and yeah I love it so also I don't know if you can tell I got so burnt I don't know if you can see a tan line no hold on let me see if I can show you because I had a weird bathing suit on there we go gosh I am so burnt and it hurts but Hey, I put a bunch of sunscreen on and so there's so much you can do. <laughs> and now my shoulders match my outfit. So, fun. I was gonna wear makeup, but honestly, after a long day at the beach, I don't have the energy and so I'm going all natural. And my go-to hairstyle is always putting it in braids and in a bun because it looks fancy and it looks like you tried, but really it's just a very quick way to just get my hair up. Um, and especially because I don't want it to get like tangled and stuff after like a long day at the beach. So this is my hairstyle for dinner. <laughs> So 
so dinner was amazing. The sushi place that we went to is so good. After that, we ended up exploring around Clearwater because random fact, but I used to live here um, way back in like 2003. Um, so we wanted to explore a little, see if like we can find like random schools and stuff I used to go to. And then we came back to the hotel, watched a movie, and now going to sleep. It is way past midnight and <laughs> we need to check out tomorrow at like 11. So yeah, and we have way more stuff planned tomorrow but in Tampa. So that should be fun, but I definitely need my sleep. Okay, it's not way past it's midnight. Marcus wants to let you guys know that I was wrong. It is 12.18. <laughs> so it's just a little bit past midnight, but I'm tired and it feels like way later than that. So I'm going to go ahead and go to sleep and see you guys in the morning. spend the day in Tampa. We're gonna have some breakfast at Oxford Exchange and then maybe get some coffee at Kansas State. Um, but yeah, we had a great evening slash morning. I packed everything up last night since I usually like to do that just so I don't feel stressed in the morning. And then the last few pieces that I needed to gather up I did this morning and I had enough time to do my makeup and look like a decent human for our little fun like date day and yeah, it should be a fun day. I'm really excited because I have never eaten at Oxford Exchange and their brunch I've heard is amazing and every single time I see like people eat it and take pictures I'm always like dying for it and I love breakfast so I'm so excited for that. I've already been drinking this gross like hotel coffee just because it was cold and I wanted something hot but I want some real coffee in Tampa so I'm looking forward to it. I'm ready for another fun day. <music> so much fun and today's food and breakfast was so yummy we ended up exploring Tampa as you guys saw went to a little plant shop I did not end up buying anything just because it was very expensive and you know I have enough plants <laughs> and so yeah we explored Tampa a little and now we are home it's already been a productive day got home to film um, a thrift with me and that should be up by now so you guys should check it out if you haven't and I think we're just gonna relax for the rest of the day Coming back from a vacation always leaves you kind of just wanting to lounge around at home and kind of bounce back. Thankfully, I have tomorrow off, so I'll be able to have a full day to kind of just 
get the house together. So I think today I'm going to edit and get that video done for you guys. But yes, hopefully you enjoyed spending the week with us. And if you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up as well as subscribe for more videos. I think it's finally going to be the time that I am going to start posting all of my wedding content. So stay tuned for that. I never posted any of it and that was back in February, but better late than never. So stay tuned for all that. I'm so excited to post and yeah, I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.